Number two, what is a non-spontaneous reaction? Okay, so this word non-spontaneous has to, maybe we can kind of tie it into, you know, normal day life, right? The definition of kind of what spontaneous means and what non-spontaneous means. If you're spontaneous, that means that you just get up and go. You just do something on a whim, right? If you're all of a sudden sitting around and say, you know, I'm going to take that trip that I always wanted and you just go, that's being spontaneous, right? So on the flip side, if you're non-spontaneous, you don't, you know, do things naturally like that. So in terms of a non-spontaneous reaction, these types of reactions do not happen naturally. The spontaneous ones, they will naturally happen, but a non-spontaneous reactions are reactions that do not happen naturally. So that's number one. These reactions do not occur under natural conditions or naturally. Okay, well then, if they don't occur naturally, you know, just, just it happens because it happens. How does this happen? Well, I guess uh, one example would be if we had graphite, which is just some carbon, right? Graphite is kind of like what's, you know, that comes out of your pencil. And this turns into diamond, the diamond, like in a diamond ring. Now it's technically graphite and diamond are both made out of just carbon, just a slew of carbon just mixed together. However, try as we might, the pencil will never turn into a diamond, you know, naturally. It's just never going to happen. However, on the flip side, over time, a diamond will convert into graphite. But we're only focusing on the non-spontaneous side. So these do not occur naturally, which means that they need a little bit of help. Well, what, what is the help? The help always comes from energy. And if they don't occur naturally and we still want them to go to produce, you know, whatever we want to produce, we need a continuous external source of energy. So these reactions need a, and the idea is that they need a continuous, continuous, I think that's how I spelled it right. They need a continuous source of external energy. So from an outside source, maybe, you know, need a continuous source of energy from an outside source. It, it means the same thing. So those are the two things in which make a non-spontaneous reaction, non-spontaneous. They're not going to occur naturally. So if that's the case and we still want them to go, it just needs a continuous, constantly running, constant amount of energy coming from somewhere. That's not part of the system. And that's it. Okay. Thank you so much. If you wouldn't mind, please press the subscribe button. That would help the channel out greatly. Um, yeah. And I look forward to answering more questions for you guys. Thank you so much. And I'll talk to you later. Okay. Bye-bye.